Here's another Tweety Tute. How to make a pillow. We have a grid and we're going to apply some remesh to it at a target of 0 0.03 and then we'll apply some UVs to it. Now we're going to create two grids out of it and we're going to apply a group to it to select the outer points using unshared edges. So we'll call this as corners A. Then I'm going to use a mirror, mirror it in the Y axis and duplicate the group here and call it corners B. Now I also want to select all the corners of this. So I'm going to mirror the actual grid over here, copy some spheres on it and use that to group the corners okay, using a bounding object. Then merge both of these together and move them slightly above ground. Now take a balloon configure in the vellum pressure, get the stiffness down to 10 and the rest length scale up to 10 as well. Okay. Now take a vellum constraint, set this to weld, set it to points and select corners A and corners B. Then take another vellum constraint and we shall pin the borders. So take pin to target, set it to points and pick up pin and set this to soft. And now finally take a solver. So take a vellum solver, turn on ground position. You can bring constraint iterations down to 50, wind drag up to about six and velocity damping to about 0.7 and press play. And that's what you'll get. Now, once you've done this much, we're going to pause this. So take a time shift and we'll do delete frame, sorry, delete channel and keep it to 20. Now take an attribute delete and delete all the attributes except the UVs. So do delete non-selected and just keep the UVs. Now we're going to take a soft body. So we'll take a vellum configure strut soft body. So you can just increase the direction jitter and increase constraints per point to 20 and take another solver, turn on ground position. But before that, we need to do one minor thing, which is we need to fuse all the corners. Okay, so just take a fuse, don't take a vellum post process. So just take a fuse, drop it in here and select corners A and B. So that will fuse all the borders for you. So just take this and press play and just let it rest for a minute. And once we're done with this, take a vellum brush and you can just shape it. Take a time shift and pause this as well. So you'll need two time shifts. So just delete the frames, keep it to 20 and feed that into the vellum brush. Just move it around to give it some shape. And lastly, we will take a UV quick shade and give it a texture. And there we go, we have a pillow. And yes, I did make that entire tutorial so I could use that texture.